I think that uh, in Denmark the, the whole singer-songwriter genre is not that popular actually. But if you, if here for example, if you're a Scandinavian musician, people will greet you uh, and uh, most people like what you do actually. So I think the kind of music I do is more uh, rare here than it is in, in Copenhagen. So mainly the, the whole vibe here with the culture and mentality as well is what I like about the city and also I was signed with a, a label that's based here in Berlin Fuhr Records. It's uh, very hard to define the what the Danish or Scandinavian sound is but uh, you can hear it when you, you hear a band from Sweden or Norway or, or Denmark it has a Scandinavian sound <laughs> like you can it's the same if you say it sounds British or American, it's, it's difficult to pinpoint what exactly makes it sound that, like that, but it's, it's just that uh, it's just there, the sound. Most uh, Scandinavian bands that play outside Denmark or Scandinavia, they sing in English. So there's uh, another accent where, for example, like British and American music sound very different. Broken dreams fill my soul. Yeah, broken dreams Blood my gold now shall I I think also the the folk tradition and the, maybe the church tradition has a lot to say whether you're from Denmark or Sweden or Germany. So music coming from Denmark that has a very melancholic sound compared to Sweden if we have to look more specific into the Danish sound I think it's more dark than the Swedish sound and why it is that I cannot answer you but I think there is a certain dark sound to pop music that comes from Denmark 